Diving into the past, staring straight into the cryptic, this is the portal to the enigmatic and the unknown. This is where history's shadows, secrets of the occult, and the interweaving secret plots come to the light. Unravel the secrets lying dormant for ages, waiting to whisper their truths. From ancient civilizations perplexing enigmas to modern-day conspiracies that shake the very foundation of belief, we explore it all. Witness testimonies, expert analyses, and a touch of skepticism. We're not just telling stories, we're seeking answers. Histories, mysteries, and conspiracies, where every mystery is a story, and every story holds a mystery waiting to be solved. Join us. The course of human history is like a great river, its tributaries, branches, and flows all connected and destined to arrive at the same ultimate destination. George Eliot, Middlemarch. In modern day, science has created a timeline of ages that man has been through. The Stone Age from 3.3 million years ago to roughly 6,000 BCE. The Bronze Age occurred from 6,000 BCE to 1200 BCE. The Iron Age went from 1200 BCE to 500 BCE. The Classical Era from 500 BCE to 500 AD. The Medieval Era from 500 AD to 1500 AD. The Early Modern Era from 1500 AD to 1800 AD. And the Modern Era from 1800 AD to the present. The Stone Age happens to represent 99% of human history, which remarkably has very little, if any, known history related to this time period. Science suggests that people were in early stages of hunter and gatherers and crafting stone tools, and that it wasn't until the Bronze Age did civilization begin. However, ancient societies seem to have a different perspective. Hesiod, an ancient Greek author, crafted the idea of ages as part of the description of temporal decline of the state of peoples through five ages, the Golden Age being the, the First Age, an age of peace, harmony, stability, and prosperity. The Golden Age people were not required to work to feed themselves because the earth provided food in great abundance. They lived to very old ages with youthful appearance and eventually dying peacefully, and their spirits living on as guardians. At the end of the First Age was the Silver Age. The Silver Age fell within the rule of the successor to the throne of Cronus, which was Zeus. Men within the Silver Age lived for 100 years under the dominion of their mothers. They lived only a short time as grown adults and spent that time in strife with one another. During this age, Men refused to worship the gods, and Zeus destroyed them for their impiety. After death, humans of this age became blessed spirits of the underworld. At the end of this age came the Bronze Age. The Bronze Age, also known as the Copper Age. The men of the Copper Age were hardened and tough, as war was their purpose and passion. Zeus created these humans out of the ash tree, their armor was forged of bronze, as were their homes and tools. The men of this age were undone by their own violent ways and left no spirits. Instead, they dwelt in the dark house of Hades. This age came to an end with the great flood of Deucalion. At the end of this age brought forth the Heroic Age. The Heroic Age is the one age that does not correspond with any metal. It is also the only age that improves upon the age it follows. It was the heroes of this age who fought at Thebes and Troy. This race of humans died and went to Elysium. The concept of Elysium was a realm of Hades that was for heroes and saints to live a blessed and happy afterlife. After the heroic age came forth the Iron Age. The Iron Age was one where human existence was one of toil and misery. Children dishonored their parents, brothers fought with brothers, and the social contract between guest and host is forgotten. During this age, might makes right, and bad men use lies to be thought good. At the height of this age, humans no longer feel shame or indignation at wrongdoing 
Babies will be born with gray hair and gods will have completely forsaken humanity. There will be no help against evil. Another ancient civilization across the earth, the Indus civilization, had a similar concept called the Hindu Yugas. Each Yuga or age is shorter than the previous one, with the proportions of the Yugas being four, three, two, one. The Yugas are also divided into a main period and two connecting periods, called Yuga Sandhyas. The Yuga Sandhyas are the dawn and dusk periods, and each lasts for 10% of the main period. Satya Yuga Also known as the Krita Yuga, or Golden Age, this was the first and most perfect Yuga. It lasted 1,728,000 years, and was characterized by austerity, cleanliness, truthfulness, and compassion. Treta Yuga also known as the Silver Age, which was the second best age, this yuga lasted 1,296,000 years. The Bull of Dharma symbolizes that morality stood on three legs during this period, which represented cleanliness, compassion, and truth. Devapara Yuga, also known as the Bronze Age, is the third and third best age, this yuga lasted 864,000 years. There are only two pillars of religion during the Devapara Yuga. Compassion and truthfulness dot the age of energy, when people were motivated by selfish goals. Kali Yuga, also known as the Iron Age, this is the current yuga and is the fourth and most degenerate. It began in 3102 BCE and will last 432,000 years, the least evolved age when people are spiritually and intellectually impoverished. The Dharma bull only stands upon one leg representing truth. On the other side of the globe in the southwestern United States, the Hopi have a belief that suggests that there were four ages of man and that the three previous ages ended with a cataclysmic event. They believe that the first age was destroyed by fire, maybe by a great comet or a volcanic eruption. The second age was destroyed by ice, perhaps the Great Ice Age. The third age was destroyed by water, perhaps the Great Deluge. Interestingly, cultures from all over the globe speak of a people existing and living within a somewhat civilized world in the previous ages. Do you think that science has failed to discover earlier histories of man? Do you there are missing chapters to the story of man? Rabo. For more content like this, like, share, and subscribe.